Round set. Executing. What's up, gamers? It's your boy, CDRAM1019. Welcome back to Tales of Monkey Island, Launch of the Screaming Narwhal. Okay, so we're looking for these four idols. We've got one down, and we're here at the second one. We've got to set these to match the same, each of the idols, to quote-unquote summon them, and help get these wins to stop uh, trapping everybody on Flotsam Island. So, let's get these done. That looks right. This one looks like it's missing a nose. Hmm, missing a nose, huh? Good thing we happen to have one. Hmm. Nice. Much better. Well, better anyway. That looks about right, actually. Nothing. Hmm, okay. Maybe I'm wrong. Oh, it's got the tongue out. I see. Duh. Hmm. I wonder what wind god that was supposed to. Ew. Broken wind. Got it. Sweet boy. Har har, very funny. Step away from that delicate machinery and give me your hand. And if I don't? Go ahead. Keep doing that. What a grouch. Okay. On to the next idol. Wherever it may be. Oh, here it is. Look at that. This one's missing one, though. I say we give it a hand. Not a bad fit. Might be a little bit of a problem, though. Aha. Oh. So that's right, put this but... Cheese back in my pants before a wandering capybara gobbles it up. No, don't... <sighs> okay, well... I need to carve faces into this thing or something. Oh, wait. Can I? Darn. There was a way to... What was the secret to this? I know it has to do with the cheese. I to The cheese. I just can't remember. Yeah, this cheese wheel is starting to go soft. Maybe I shouldn't be storing it in my pants. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, wait, wait. Darn. Alright, well, I know this cheese wheel needs to go here. I just don't remember... Oops. How to get the face on it. And I don't think I can just place it here and use it. Not a bad fit. It definitely fits. The question is just... I wonder what I'm doing wrong. Yeah, I must be missing something. Um, Alright, maybe we'll come back to this. Alright, let's go back to the entrance. See if I can find that final idol. So we did that one. Uh, that's the messed up idol. And I don't think I've visited this one yet. Oh, okay, never mind. So that's where the strange idol is. Let's go to the messed up idol then. doesn't even have an axle. It'll never work like this. Okay. Uh, well. Nope. What would I possibly use for an axle? I don't think that a YouTube would be useful there. Well. That's a problem. 
Hmm. All right, well, I guess we got to go back to the dock and look for some more clues. Actually, I had a thought about the other one with the cheese head. Um, I think that I can go to the doorway. Oh, wait, I need the actual cheese head first. Alright, so I think that I can... I, I know I need to make an impression on the cheese. I know that much. Question is what I need to use it with. If I go in here, this will just take me here, right? Okay. So that's not going to help. Hmm. Alright, let's go back to the strange one and get the cheese back. <laughs> Let's take this. Okay. Um. Oh wait, no. Grab the. I better put this cheese back in my pants before a wandering capybara gobbles it up. All right. So. Betcha I need to go back into town. Must be something that's biting me right in the... in the face. Ah! There it is. Subtle. Um, I have to take this cheese and imprint these jail carvings. I know what would cheer up these gruesome carvings. Cheese! Nope, still menacing. Oh, and now my cheese wheel is staring at me. <laughs> that one is very subtle. Okay, uh, we got what we need here. Okay. Let's finish this one up. I didn't think it was possible, but this idol's cheesier than ever. Okay, so I'm pretty sure that it was. Oop, that was it. Okay. Should have worn my chinos today. Ah, that must be the wind that makes you reconsider wearing shorts. <laughs> mm, no sign of the marquee. Good. All that shooting was giving me a headache. Okay, well, let's head back to the last one and see if we can figure out what we need to do. Manic messed up idol. Okay, let's figure out the final wind idol thingy and get the heck sleepwood. Oh, jeez. How'd you beat me here anyway? <laughs> Once I heard the search engine the wind, it was child's play for a scientifically trained intellect of my stature to deduce which of the four winds remained. That makes sense. So now what? So now what? Now, my annoying pirate friend. You hand over that ancient liverometer device. I restore the winds to their full sucking force. And you accompany me to my laboratorium so that I can properly remove and study your hand with the pointy sticks of science! Yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna do that. The thing with the seahorse on it! Oh, yeah, I don't think I'll be giving you that. Um, oh. ow. It's a good thing the Singe's rifle is just as wimpy as the man who built it. You're still here? But of course. Hey, look! It's King Louis the Twelfth! My liege! I thought you were dead! I have an idea. Mm -mm. What was that fooping sound? Beats me. 
Now, if you'll just stop waving that rifle around, I've got some winds to change. Not so fast, insignificant pirate person. Sacre merde. <laughs> ah, that's right. Dinge is supposed to be the axle that I need. And then the clue here, because I still can't use this. Yep. Oop, stop. That should do it. Talk to the hand, sicko, cause the pirate ain't listening. Ugh, mark my words, Sweetwood. You'll rue the day you cross the Marquis de Singe. And your little hand, too. <laughs> rue? I don't know the meaning of the word. Well, looks like my work here is done. I better hurry back to the screaming narwhal before the flotsamites get wind of the, um, wind. Ben Winslow, where are you? Right here, sir. Raise anchor and get us the heck out of here before the winds change. With pleasure, Captain. Back on the sea. Congratulations, sir. The screaming narwhal has successfully escaped from Bloxham Island. Where to now? Uh, let's see. Let's go to Rock Gelato. Mr. Van Winslow, if you would be so kind, I would like you to set sail for... I said set a course for me. Oh, come on. Come on, what, sir? Mm. Okay, well, we've still got a little bit of a problem. Sir, set a course for here. Hey. Whoa. Ow. Hmm. Look, Mike, looks like my hand's being a little bit of a pain. Got to figure out a way to get it under control here. Mm, this tar might be useful. Wow. Ugh. Uh, do I have anything I can use? Uh, I still got all this stuff here, but... I don't think anything short of explosive force is going to open up that tar barrel. Do I need to turn the cannon? Nothing like a deafening cannon discharge to clear the mine. Hmm. Well, I can shoot the cannon, but <laughs> oh, there we go. That's something. Mm. There we go. That's just swell. My brand new ship's all covered with tar. This is all your fault, you know. Ow! Hey, 
I bet this sticky puddle of tar would be perfect for trapping my evil hand. Well, I guess I shouldn't have tipped my, um, hand. Uh... That's what I call a sticky situation. <laughs> okay, well, what do I... Can I jump off the mast? Ugh, I hate scrubbing tar off my main mast. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I don't think I have anything else I can use to jump on jump on that tar. Ow. I'll sleep when I'm dead. Or later tonight. Um I can't just knock myself back. Nothing like a deafening cannon discharge to clear the mind. Ow. <sighs> Another tar barrel. Alright, well, worth a try. get this right eventually. <laughs> I know I have to stick myself in that tar. The trick is just... Winslow? Just go where I point. Oh, come on. Ugh, stupid boxed hand. Joe? There we go. Mr. Winslow, make way for... The Rock of Gelato. Aye, aye, Captain. There we go. Get me some grog for this hand. Finally, the Rock of Gelato. Now to find Elaine. Mr. Van Winslow, my spyglass. Aye, aye, sir. Elaine's ship looks pretty good, considering that it was exploding the last time I saw it. Where's my ship? And Elaine? Is she out looking for me? Is she still in the Chuck's clutches? Is her beautiful bloated corpse slowly rotting at the bottom of the... Hey! What's that? Winslow, enhance the upper right quadrant 50%. <laughs> it's my ship! Winslow, full enhancement! <laughs> Elaine! I'm coming, Plunder Bunny! Wait, what's that? Oh no, it's the Chuck. Elaine, look out! Thunder Bunny? Guide Rush Threepwood. I've been waiting a long time for this. Um, could you wait a little longer? Ooh, ominous. To be continued in Siege of Spinner K. All right, that does it for chapter one. Visiting professor of monkeyology, Ryan, Ron Gilbert. <laughs> Wonder how much uh, involvement he actually had with this game. Armstrong testing lead. These could go by a little faster. <laughs> K 
console manual. That's right. These were uh, these were available for uh, the Wii, the PC, and I think they might have been available on the 360. I'm not certain. Tim Talbot, DeSinge, DeOro, Alexandra Boyd. I think they got the original Elaine back. Dominic Armado for Guybrush, Adam Harrington's LeChuck. Tim Talbot was Nipperkin. Curated with the Telltale tool. Yeah, that's right. These, um... These five uh, chapters of Tales of Monkey Island are not built on uh, script creation or story creation utility for uh, Maniac Mansion. They don't use scum, so um, they're uh, completely different from the other games. Actually, I don't know if um, Escape used scum either. The first two obviously did. Three is kind of up in the air, but... You. Yes, you. Special thanks to LucasArts. Telltale pets. And two monkey babies were born. Har, har, har. All right. Our journey has only just begun. Thank you for joining me, everyone, on the first chapter of tales of monkey island uh next time you'll be seeing me might be a game in between and then we'll come back to tales in chapter two siege of spinner k uh but until then uh make sure you check out the rest of the videos on the gsl youtube channel check out official ytr.com slash forums for more fun and myself at twitch.tv slash chaos control channel but until our next adventure I've been CDROM 1019, you've been you, and you have been awesome. So take care. Bye bye! Thank you.